up guys? We're doing chess today. I'm heading for 135. As you can see, there's a plate. These are fake plates. Just so you know, they're not fake. Are you fake, Steve? Pardon? Anyway. Good action. We're start with this. I'm heading for five, and then we're gonna... I'm gonna on the first three sets, we're gonna do five, and then on the last four, the first set, we're gonna hit it for eight repetitions. I might do maybe 2 205 on the bench. Try to hit for eight, and if I feel good, I might do an extra set. And then from there, it drops it. So, start with this. Okay, on to the next set. So here he is, benching five. One, two. Looks good. Uh, that last one, I don't know. If you're wondering what's in that drink, that's a secret. I'll let you know in the, in the description. <laughs> Secret. <laughs> okay, second set. Minute for five, I think that's like Okay, he's gonna do it for 135. Then he hit it for five reps. See how he does. Hey, keep it steady. Keep it steady. He's gonna get happy again. I don't feel like you. I don't feel like you. No, I'll go you were different. Now you're really hitting you more because you're hitting it. I'm kinda of lagging a little bit. <laughs> I'm sluggish today, but don't worry, next day I'll get it. Give it one more set, I'm gonna try to hit for eight. Man, it's like a warm right there or something. I'm I think I'm infected by something. Oh. What do you think it is? Leave it in the comments. Like one one forty on the bench. I'm gonna power through it, take your time. Come on, bro. One more. Push. That's good. Ah, oh, yeah, see? Look at the games. Look at the games. You never want to try on your maximum because you're not part of this. You want to try to just build the chest, build some strength. So that's what you call like a hybrid build, power bottom bodybuilder. So if you don't lift like a par, par lifter, like we're trying to lift the most heaviest possible, like one one rep maximum. But we're trying to rep it out for like good amount of reps, maybe eight to twelve range, uh, just to build more on the chest. That's what you want. So, you know, to incorporate strength, what high purchase be? That's good for muscle building and working on strength too. Hyper build. There you go. Anyway. Oh shit! That was that. Something wrong with my chest. But anyway. Just <laughs> kidding, guys. You're kidding. Or am I? Leave it in the 
leave it in the comments. I think I'm kidding. Push it. Ah. Come on. More. Push it. Your, your left going down. Oh my god, dude. Dean <laughs> got it? Remember, power through with your legs. Push your legs too. Breathe. Hold your energy in. There you go. It's a good beat taper. Push it. Push it. Come on. Come on. A little better or what? needs to be strong. Everything tight. <laughs> Tighten up. There you go. Oh my god. Woo! I think that was 10. Yeah. Look at notice my it, when you take the wrist back a little, you kind of lose a little power. And if you take it too high up, you have no power because you're not getting your laps enough. We're gonna keep more more midpoint. That's why you emphasize more in power, especially when you use your quads and retract your scapula. As your chest comes up more, more uh, squeeze in your chest. Yeah, so I need to work on that. Although my wrist pull too far back, so slightly back is fine, I guess. And I should be able to perform better next time. <laughs> That's good. It's good right there. Double press. Uh, chest press. That is loud, isn't it? Great announcement for our ghost gym associates. Anyway, back to chest. I'm going to try to hit this for a good high repetition of maybe 10 to 12, maybe 15. But let's see what happens. You know, I might. My 80 pounds this, this week. I'm going to eat a lot. Do five sets. Let's do it. That felt good. Sixty. Oh, Sixty pounds. 
when I hit it for 12 or something. Good right range. Uh, get the stretch in the chest. Um, I'll show and demonstrate how to do it. Just watch me. Um, this, is good, this is good chest exercise. You want to get a full stretch in the chest. You can use this as a finisher or you can finish with the cables. But we're going to try something different. We might do cables after, depending on how you feel. But here we go. Take your back, your scapula, your tack, your scapula. Sweet chest. Far Take it in front of you. Not, not behind you like this, but in front of you. Like that. Two, eight to twelve. I'm gonna do 15. Stretch at the bottom. Let it stretch at the bottom. Let the waist take it down. But you control it, so. The reason why I keep your legs up is so you keep yourself a little more uh, stabled. And this is a better way 
well, using more of your chest and not um, overcompensating with your legs to get the lift. Okay, take the dumbbells underneath you, bring it forward. Squeeze out the top for a second or two. Three seconds even better, but one or two seconds is good. Remember guys, you want to uh, get right, grab an appropriate weight that's challenging for you. You don't want to go too heavy because yeah, it's not going to help you. We're not, again, like I said, we're not going to try to, we're not powerlifters or bodybuilders. Well, I am. Or power bodybuilder. <laughs> do they feel like three sets or something? I feel like I can do three sets. Focus, you, you forget about everything. You just do what you're doing. Of course, why would you want to go out of focus? You know, we're going to focus on your when you try to focus your muscle, right? If you, if you lose focus, chances are you're not going to get a good uh, workout, right? Because you're looking at other people or you're thinking about something else and then kills the workout a little bit. You, know, you want to keep at it, you want to keep focusing on that particular muscle group. And I think that's the best way to make the most gains, in my opinion. But, you can do it however you want, but the results, I'm <laughs> just kidding guys, but seriously though. Anyway, let's make this chess game. Imagine you're like a butterfly or a bird. One more. Oh, okay. Drop sitting in it. Stretch out right here and then push through underneath. Maybe for 10 or something. This gets a lot harder every time. Finish off with this, that'll be the end of the workout. Um, yeah, we got time almost time, close time just goes uh, for hit, hit it for like 10 12. I might hit it for 15. I 
feel like you can take it underneath your chest more. Get more of those squeezes out of the whole chest. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, be edit that out. Uh, people, nope. right, you want to keep your um, PG thirteen for the kitties. <laughs> the kitties, kitty cats. Those kitties, you know, the mommy's like, oh, lotion. What are you talking about, mommy? <laughs> anyway, check. Tell me like the pulse. <laughs> That's 10 to 12. So that's the end of the workout. Hope you like it. If you do, please comment, share, and of course, subscribe to McBuffin Fitness. As always, stay buffing.